What is going on guys and welcome back to another fishing adventure. Today, whoa, whoa, whoa. Today we're back at the trout spot and we're gonna go see if this spot has been fished out or not. I came out here yesterday later in the day, didn't catch anything, but a crap ton of people have been asking me if this lake is fished out and I have no idea. I have not been here in a long time. So that is what we're figuring out today. Let's go fishing. Check out that catfish. I don't know if y'all can see it, but there's like a weird fog or smoke. Doesn't smell like smoke though. But today, today we get to use the Okuma SST trout rod for the first time. It is an ultra light rod. So I am stoked to have this. But uh, yeah, it's gonna be sick. Let's get some baits. Got some power bait in here. Oh, let's go with that one. That one and that one. This is our choices of bait today. Uh, it's pretty windy. Wind's pretty cold. I was not expecting that. It's not windy at the house. Oh, these trout are small on this lake. Better not go too big. There's one. Let's go ahead and cast her out. I may do a catch and cook today. If we catch a good size, we'll do a catch and cook. Trout catch and cook, baby. There we go, that was beautiful. Beautiful. All right, there's one. Do me good. Corn. Whew. A bit nipply. And then for this rod. Oh yeah. Ultra lightweight, freaking awesome. This is gonna be fun to catch some trout on. Especially at Medi Park where they're pretty big. Once that lake melts, we will go over there and catch some big old trout on this ultra light rod. Ooh -wee. The baits are kind of hard and frozen. Been in the car overnight. All right. All rigged up. Now let's catch some freaking trout. I guess I'll throw this one over here in the mud where I almost fell yesterday. Yep, just weeds. No one's here on a Saturday. I mean, it is still cold, but it's not that cold. Maybe this place is fished out. But it's only been about 20 minutes, so I'm not gonna call it just yet. Got way out there that time. All right, so I gave this spot one hour and zero bites. So I'm gonna try to shoot across the lake over there and see how we can do over there. There is ice over there, but I'm just gonna do my best to avoid it. This spot is definitely looking fished out. I hope Medi Park melts soon because that's our only option right now. Until the walleye come back, but that's gonna be in spring. We're getting there, but we're not there yet. But the weather is warming up, so I also want to start traveling. Go to different lakes, different spots, fish new species. All right, on to the next spot. Welp. This spot is all still ice, never mind. Ah. That sucks. I f yeah, it's way out there. That looks melted right here, but it's also ice. So the layer after that, the darker blue is not ice. That's way too far. That's probably my max cast distance right there. Uh, oh man. I'm gonna go check out over here. I may just go ahead and say that this lake is fished out. I couldn't really give all of the spots a try because the ice, but I think it's just safe to say. Okay, um, there's like literally 15 feet out, a little melted spot, but that's way too shallow. I can see there's not fish right there. <laughs> but yeah, the rest of it is ice. 
All right, I'm gonna go ahead and call it. This spot has been fished out. That just means I have to drive an hour to get to the other trout spot where the trout are way bigger anyways, so. It's a win-win. But that sucks because that lake is still frozen, frozen, so. That will be a few days before I can go there. Oh, baby. All right, day two of testing out if the lake is fished out. I was going to go to Medi Park today, but the wind is going to be absolute sh today. So those plans got canceled. So I have about an hour and a half to go fish the local lake before the wind just tears me a new one. So the new plan is to go back to the lake I was just at yesterday and do some more testing on it. Hopefully we can go out there and catch some fish. I hope it's not too windy right now. I think the wind is at like 10 mile per hour at the moment. So let's go out there and hopefully catch a trout. The first fish in a week. All right, good news. All of the ice on the lake has melted. So that's good. I'm gonna fish here for about an hour. Maybe jump over to the other side, try that side before the wind hits. All right. Don't know where my rod holder is. All right, no rod holder, sick. Sick. Who needs them? <laughs> okay, let's throw on the corn. We need to catch a trout today. It's been a week since I've caught a fish and I need to fill the tug. All right, so we got the corn on that rod and on the ultralight rod, we're gonna throw on this orange and green mixture. There's the wind. Clouds are coming in quick. I cannot freaking wait to go to Medi Park and catch a freaking trout on this rod. The trout over there are pretty big and it's gonna be super fun on this ultralight. I'm hoping by tomorrow that lake should be melted. This lake is all melted. No more ice. I'm hoping it's the same in Amarillo. And I also hope that the wind won't be horrible tomorrow. Alright. The wind is getting really bad. I'm going to give up on this spot. I fished for about an hour. And I'm going to shoot across there. And try on that side. But uh. It's not looking good. Day two, no bites. Okay, so I'm just taking one pole down here. I don't have high expectations. Do I hear that wind? Lovely. <laughs> Blew the hook out of my hand. This is why I couldn't go to Amarillo today and go catch some bigger trouts. The wind is going to get even worse later on in a few hours. Yeah, I think it's time to call it. This is horrible. Well guys, say goodbye to this lake. I will not be coming here anymore. No more videos at this lake on my channel. So, well, until next winter or unless they stock it again. but. I don't think they're gonna stock this lake again this season. It's about to get pretty warm, so. Say goodbyes, goodbye lake. We had a good run. We caught a lot of trout out of here this winter. It's been fun, but I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll catch y'all in the next one. Peace.